system. So, so they are composed of cells tissues, organs, and systems. Now the first thing we'll talk about is cells. So that, so that classification of cells. Support the human body. Very tiny. You cannot see them with the naked eye. So, what is a cell? Here are some here are some classification of cells. A. Cells are very tiny. B. They support the body. So they. So they also fight bacteria. So these are 
so this is the classification of cells. Cells are very tiny. They support the body and they fight bacteria. A bacteria is not some kind of ninja. Okay. Let me draw the picture of a cell in this diagram. I'm going to show you. The liquid, the liquid and the water. Water thing in a cell is called the cytoplasm. What is inside the cell membrane? So there are some things called vacuum. Animals have small vacuum. That's why there's the vacuum. And vacuum. Nucleus. The animals here, yeah, that's a nucleus. And I forgot the cell membrane. Membrane. Maybe there was one thing I wish I could know, the protoplasm. There's something called the cell wall, but it's in plant cells, not in animal. So I will definitely shut down that. So I uh have -huh. there is the part of a, of an animal cell. Meaning the diagram. But, okay. I have to write tissues once again and cells too.
are the three main types of classifying cells. What is it? That's right, A, A. They are very tiny. That means they cannot, you cannot see it with the naked eye. Two, they support the human body. They help us live healthy and healthy, healthy and healthy, healthy and healthy till they are infinity years. Three, they fight bacteria. Like the, like the one I just told you, it was just like a ninja. Let me show you what I mean. Suppose you have this human body. So, you come in, fight the bug tonight inside. That's making us healthy. I'm cleaning the tap. Like if that will work. Thank you all for watching my video. Next time we'll be talking about tissues, the next organs, the next systems. Bye.